Good evening to all of you. I'm Dr. Deshan Priyankara, and I would like to warmly welcome all of you on behalf of the Ceylon College of Physicians who have joined on this online platform to the first Beyond Medicine talk for the year 2023. And most of you all know the Beyond Medicine program has gained much interest among our colleagues as well as who love to listen and engage in activities that are beyond medicine. And at the same time, I believe that this helps us in various ways in our day-to-day -day medical practice as well, as much of our practice of medicine lies beyond medicine. The first event was held in Gaul in February as a live event. For those who couldn't attend, uh, CCP has arranged it to be broadcast as a recorded version today. So uh, today's speaker is Professor uh, Harshini Rajapakshi. Uh, just to introduce uh, Professor Harshini Rajapakshi, uh, she is a professor in psychiatry at the Faculty of Medicine, University of Rohana, and a specialist in psychiatry at the Teaching Hospital Karapitiya. In addition to her multiple degrees in the field of academia, furnished with an MBBS, MD psychiatry, and a PhD, she holds two interesting accolades. She is a Visharad in North Indian classic music and Kathak dancing, having qualified for the University of Bath, Khande, India, and holds a Hindi language competency certificate from Dakshina Bharat Hindi Pracha Sabha. She is also listed as a grade A performer by the SLBC. And further, uh, her talents in music. She followed a certificate course in music uh, for wellness from Berkeley College of Music and later followed a certificate course in preventing chronic pain in the University of Minnesota, USA. Uh, Professor Rajapaksi has delivered many speeches in regional, national, and international fora on culture, aesthetics, music, and drama. Translating her multiple talents into practice, she tries to bridge the gap between the modern day science of medicine and the art of healing through her talents in music, arts, and humanities. Music for Healing, a monthly program at the Palliative Care Center of the Teaching Hospital Karapitya Gaul is one such example. So without much delay, I would uh, let you all enjoy this Saturday evening with this interesting topic of a uh, glimpse into the evolution of Sri Lankan music. And if you have any comments or queries, you may drop them into Q&A box. And then the, the Professor Raj Paksa will be more than happy to answer you all. So thank you very much. I would let you listen to this wonderful talk. Bhavande pula somi gunehi latave ruan velak mini Aminulatavi Guantalin Bessi Malvarusavi Pemini Obata Sita Dimivatavi Bana Dahami Guna Tundova Petirayana Anasaka Pavatin Vaime Muluderana Anavina dos dos Anavina roga dos durukar balavadana Gana devi nu en leb sato sin avadana Gana devi nu en leb sato sin avadana Avada I move. Good evening to all of you. Thank you very much, Prasivi Ratna, for the introduction. So we started with the blessings from Shanti Karma. Uh, and thank you, President and the Council of Ceylon College of Physicians uh, for the invitation to share some of my thoughts with you all this evening. And uh, I would like to thank and also invite uh, uh, the medical students from the Faculty of Medicine, uh, Mr. Vimod uh, Navaratna uh, for percussion, uh, Mr. Ashan Devind, keyboard, uh, Mr. Srilak Jayatesa, guitar, and Piyumi uh, Hema Singh uh, for violin. Uh, and also, uh, Sandali, you are here, Miss <laughs> Sandali. Dilakaratna, please join us in singing 
we were all singing together for so many years and dr dasun prabhashwara both guitar and vocals and my son and daughter desh and dili for vocals and western flute so please come and please give them a hand there'll be a company so after um, talking about meditations and all that so we are going to change the whole thing right uh, to a light kind of a mood um, so the topic was i thought it's too too wide and big but anyway uh, it's a glimpse like a peekaboo right just a glimpse into evolution of sri lankan music so when you say music it's vocal instrumental sometimes in some definitions it goes beyond that including dancing and uh, various other things so sri as sri lankans we are singhala tamils burgers a lot of we we are there so i thought of uh, going through few articles and see now with the evolution singhala music has changed a lot but why didn't the the tamil music has uh, changed but usually it has always um, there's some kind of a link with the tamil nadu music or the other the other tamil uh, or other uh, four states like karnataka tamil nadu uh, and other states uh, uh, andhra uh, and uh, uh, kerala right those four they go together with those music but uh, singhala music has influenced a lot from all these music styles and the other english speaking people the burgers they have certain styles but they also usually later on converted into full uh, english kind english or the western type of music so here it's uh, the the most variations are seen in singhala music but nonetheless i will touch a bit on tamil and uh, burgers the music used by them so the ancient sri lanka uh, uh if you have listened to professor raj somadeva he has uh, found certain interesting instruments we have used in those days especially we were an agricultural country and these flutes and uh, this uh, the uh, other bera or the drums uh, were there and initially uh, people have used like in tribal communities the body as a percussion instrument you know when you tap we get a sound and the place where you tap gives a different kind of uh, musical kind of a tone and uh, in sri lanka later on they developed this panchaturyanada that is called athatha vithatha vithatha athatha gana and srushira so athatha is uh, you use your hand to beat the drum vithatha is you use the sticks and hand and sticks vithatha athatha gana is you uh, put two uh, solid things together and make a noise and srushira is the wind instrument so all these were there in ancient sri lanka and people have used music uh for leisure to communicate other people with other people and also to uh exchange uh, certain important messages like war and things like that so folk music is uh, uh, it's a very uh, the variety is very large and uh, certain types are very slow going lovely uh, soothing rhythms for instance one is na na vi le e na
So it's a very soothing rhythm. But in Hatangi, uh, that is uh, during the war, people uh, created these things. Yudde tatte vit sindu pitane unagi la parangi unna mutte vit kola bata gude behela. And the matsundai kisi bisi gala kolambadi kampala netat senegak maradala. So they use their own language to express themselves and according to the uh, whatever the job they did. So there are certain uh, types of poetry they sang, Karatta Kavi, Paru Kavi, Pal Kavi. So each of these has its own. Mm, uh, uh, own help, give the help to the, the whatever the profession or whatever the job they do. Now, for instance, if somebody is in a hut in the night, it's very monotonous life. So, from one hut to the other, they sing palkavi. So, this palkavi, they they stop at different points. Now, uh, I'm giving an example. Vilayak fall into sleep. Gondenek kakauni inek goni valiga netiv veni veni. So when, when one person says, the other person gives the answer from the other hut. And also the lullabies were popular these, uh, in this area. To, that is, I think, one of the primary things we started singing uh, as a nation. So in Tamil, there's nice lullaby. I will sing two lines of this. Sainradma, Sainrad. Tamari puvai saindrade. So like that, they, they imagine things and they compare those to with the child. And araro, 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 arevaro, arevaro, araro, araro. Arivaro. And in our Vedda community, Roroi, 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 Abol, Tente, Dinane, Te Dinane, Bol. So these are different styles we had. So from those days, even up to now, they pass from generation to generation, and new people incorporate these tunes to their new creations. Then the religious music. The religious music started from the Kovils, temples, churches, and every religion has its own musical things. Even Muslim religion, the Sufi Muslims sing songs and they are very nice. That style is usual in the weddings and functions. They sing very beautiful songs. They are known as Kavali. Uh, and, uh, even so, certain sectors of Muslim they don't, but Sufi Muslims they do sing, and the pejandri music uh, for uh, Asala Perahara in uh, Kandy. There's a particular tune they they used to play in the uh, Kandy Perahara, and also Shanti Karma. Uh, as I mentioned you earlier, the first blessing was given using a Shanti Karma uh, Kavir. And uh, passions and carols, all these things give a nice uh, flavor to our music. Uh, hope you all know now it's a song, but the very first time when the musicians were asked to come and sing for, uh, grade, they grade the musicians. Uh, so Lata Valpola, our very uh, loved uh, female vocalist, uh, she sang Namo Mariani Namo Mariani Namo Mariani Prasad 
ਪਦ ਪੂਰਨਵੰਤਿਨੀ so that was the song she knew and they graded her the best grade singer so like that the these religious music influenced our music and uh, we incorporate that into modern day music so we'll give one example where that this uh, nuara perahara uh they have various items panteru is one of them you know what a panteru is uh, so this panteru natuma we'll sing uh, these uh, kavi right patini devi duge salamba walalla salamba walalla surat darmi pante ru walalla te ru walalla so using this as a base and certain uh, other rhythms used in mahanwara kandi perahara uh, jananath varakagoda sings this beautiful song uh, so i hope they sh- can sing that for us tonight a part of it uh, so this is a beautiful song uh, which represent pageant music so we are a part so communication is a bit of a problem yes madure sire dalada asin hande teva kirisayur parada vevraum vat ranchu gasuna magol madu langa katira kodiya bim kapmpeti pol edi singhanad patura ganno rupira satan vilila ahala mahat rantoli vadinawa nuwara hadai ves natuma natanawa madure siri dalada asin hande teva kiri sayur parada vevraum vat ranchu gasuna mahaveli komali nuwarat asiri supatal pera deniyam mavin piri Midum purava mi mure hanga dumbar padurak ratavanda lok urum nam hadavat randa madure siri dalada asin hande teva kiri sayur parada vevraum vat ranchu gasuna embekke gadala deniyamu kand udrat nam rak gamu satar at deviyan pamin natar unu tan mahanuwar satar at deviyan pamin natar unu tan mahanuwar so using these uh, simple traditional music even today uh, our people are making beautiful kind of music uh, and here the phases are from the heart of sanniya so in low country in our part there are 18 sannis and uh, 12 palis so when somebody is ill they perform this ritual using these masks and uh, we call it dahata sanniyai dolaha paliyai we are doing that and it's a very uh, illustrious very it's a one night ritual but there are now brief or shorter forms of that now it's mainly performed in uh, 
hotels for the foreigners. That's the sad thing about it. Uh, those days, uh, when we were kids, we used to go and uh, see these things and it was really nice. So those mesmerizing memories are still with us. And uh, these faces, all they have a particular meaning, right? So that will be another lecture. <laughs> so we'll move to the next stage. The, the, all these the previous ones, are they were never written. They were passed from generation to generation by the teacher to the student or the family uh, kind of. But these the Vanna, Prashasti and uh, Sandesha, Kavya, uh, they belong to, uh, uh, under uh, those uh, music, they, we call them Segi, like because the scholars have written them and it is influenced uh, in a uh, lot of Sanskrit things are there and uh, written according to the rules of literature and the poetry and Vannam, Especially, they one num are accompanied with uh, dancing items. So, this gajaga, turanga, one num is uh, you praise someone or you varnana. Varnam, the uh, Tamil word varnam has converted to one num in Singhala. And uh, Sandesha Kavya, there are a lot of Sandesha Kavya in Singhala. And I would like all of you all to. Uh, Sing our group and with the audience. One from Salalihini Sandesha, very famous one. Uh, it's written in Samudra Gosha Virita. Right? Pesarnia Mini Peminia Cotton. Agate Bandaki Kinia Ladagi Hinia Viman Samudra goes in this, the goes like the waves in the sea, goes up, comes down, right? There's a nice rhythm. So, Prashasti are uh, to sort of to tell good about the uh, rulers, kings, and things. I think all of you all may have written, uh, listened to uh, uh, these Prashastis now <coughs> and then as well, uh, but the old ones are really nice. Mm. Uh, one of them. Uh, Paramati Subha Charite Lankapati Narendra Singha Nupati So those are heavy with Sanskrit language. So there are so many beautiful but the tunes are very nice um, and uh, still, we can uh, uh, remember those beautiful uh, prashastigi. And th those things have influenced our music. If you listen to this uh, song, uh, like uh, the, uh, the Rukkattana Malamudune, you can hear a little bit of that. It's mainly based on the Vannama, Ukusa Vannama. Tana. Tanat, 
ृक्कल मुदुने वामु नाटन है आदुर पियमांकर खाऊ देने पुतुनी बालान यो मानुआन खाऊ देने so you can see the beauty how they have incorporated this into modern music and then comes these are the uh, traditional dramas kola sokari and puppetry uh, so kola actually three all these three uh, came around the same time but sokari Uh, they believe that it came first, and it's a more kind of up country uh, drama thing where they uh, make a uh, make a uh, open theater for sokari, and there's a story about the sokari, and they do it one as a uh, you know pay to pay respect to God Patini, Goddess Patini, and God Katharagama, and also as a harvesting. uh you know enjoying the harvest uh, after the harvest is harvest was taken and then they perform sokari uh, so there are various characters and uh, the certain words are in tamil because sok- sokari comes from india uh, so these dialogues are very interesting and the songs are also very interesting so we'll sing please uh, we shall we sing together सोकरी एनी सब इन अवसर गानी नानी ताल राग की पद आलानी पियुरुलम सोलानीपत गानी जुरा तीन मून बलानी सो यू मे हैव Uh, seen this uh, in uh, Jackson and Tani's son is doing it beautifully nowadays. But from those days, this uh, uh, beautiful uh, stay like dialogues and the poetry are there in Sokari. And Kola is the same thing, but the low country version, which we uh, in low country usually they used it for leisure and to show their displeasure against the. Uh, english uh, or the other the rulers uh, but falesha things are jasya lenchina also then again uh, this uh, the people who are in power abuses the other people and this struggle is shown so they have used in psychiatry we psychology we say humor is a very good defense mechanism so humor they use to the maximum uh, they are the jasya lenchina kolam there are this the, the kavi are like this na ki unat mat kam nete tav nondi ka kul kut ad yate tav nondi ka kul kut ad yate eet vada muge av gate मागे दोस तैनिन तैन पवसते मागे दोस तैनिन तैन पवसते सो दि सेम ट्यून आई थिंक दे हैव टेकन लिंचीना मागे नांगी ऐ अंबलांगोड 
luckily they have preserved most of the puppets and if you go and if you visit there uh, you can see even the uh, kolam masks they still preserve them it's a good place to visit i suggest a ccp president <laughs> to think about that it's a nice place to go and see so we'll all sing this song anna balan sandar antakien they'll provide music i want all of you all to join and this is from a noorthi call kundala kesi right uh, and it's it was earlier uh, noorthi one and then some people uh, did a drama and a film as well so please join so you will have music ಸುಲಾ ಹತ ಶೋಕ ತೇವುಲ್ ಹತ ಶೋಕ ತೇವುಲ್ back to many years where every saaj every bajawa uh, included this song so the bajawa words also in hindi uh, to play is bajao so they when they gather for a since they shout bajao bajao so we also said bajao right we all sing together that's a bajao right and then we'll move that uh, from uh, this uh, so- song uh, it belong to noorthi and there are two other things i want to mention nadagam noorthi and the minerva dramas the old dramas right so nadagam actually came first 
and it has lot of carnatic music influence so most of the tunes are based on carnatic music and uh, sometimes they directly put words to the tamil song and they sang again it's a outdoor the stage is outdoor and lot of people gather around and some uh, of those are bramford balasanta uh, those are the uh, nadagams they, they in tamil law so i think the same word the nadagam is uh, used now what is nadagam ki <laughs> vama vena terumat thiyena but it's the drama nadagam uh, we are using and i think uh, desh will you sing uh, one from balasanta nadagam gambirate dati konstanti nupure gambirate dati konstan tinupure konstan tinupure puravardana karana aga narnaame mang puravandana karana aga narnaame mang namaya mang ali sandire namaya mang ali sandire mam dharmin me pura palan karamin ne dharmin me pura palan karamin ne inne madure priti avindimin ne inne madure priti avindimin ne gambir te dati konstan tinu pure konstan tinu pure pura vandana karana ag nar naame mang nar naame mang nar naame mang so that is from uh, bela santa nadagam so there are lot of songs usually i think our grandparents they used to sing shant jon ge vidi kadi malu vel dam malu vel dam shant jon ge shant jon ge shant jon ge vidi kadi so these are beautiful memories we have and uh, still we are enjoying those music and mainly the uh, instrument the percussion instrument used is called maddala uh, maddala is still we use for some uh, uh, stage dramas especially uh, nadagam based stage dramas like maname singha bahu you may have seen the maddala is the main instrument uh, and uh, so the the gentleman uh, with the coat is uh, mr sidon bastian and then uh, the other one is charles dias then john the silva and ew jayamana right so when the when when the noorthi came uh, usually nadagam were because they we had to they have to stay up and with all this vilakku and uh, other equipment so they moved to a theater inside theater one that is known as noorthi and the music is based on mainly the north indian classical music uh, other the, nowadays we use tabla which is there but early days we use something called pakwaj pakwaj is like if you fix the two parts of the tabla together it's a instrument like that the 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 beats or what you call padar are different from tabla beats and a uh, lot of noorthi what what we just sang is a noorthi ge and there are a lot of other things we remember shri aman matvi mage dekala unmad ve viharde amb damb narang ke sel dil pana ka ka me vanas pa labnim 
So there are so many beautiful songs. And then the later, latter part was the Minerva drama group. They came and they turned this. Some of the Nadagam became Noorthi. Noorthi became Minerva stage shows. And uh, Mr. Jayamana uh, is the pioneer of these things. And those are the things which later turned to uh, films or the cinema. So these music, the both North Indian and the South Indian classical bass came from Nadagam and Nunurti and still those uh, things are still we use them. Minerva group also contributed but they, uh, you know, slightly uh, changed the tunes and try to make different melodies and with lot of uh, uh, dialogues in simple Sinhala. And uh, when the Portuguese people came with them, uh, they brought baila and kafir music. Uh, I don't know how this happens in, in Portugal and uh, the other countries. The baile, baile is the dance and kafir is the music. But usually for us, baila is the music and kapirinha is the Dance, ne kapirinya natanoa ne ne kapirinya natanoa baila kia noa, right? So baila uh, baile is actually um, like it's kind of a ballet, kind of a short verses were sung in fast rhythms. So when Portuguese Portugal has uh, colonies both in Africa as well as Asia, so when they came to us, this original music is slightly changed and some of the African uh, influences also there, especially in the, there are a group of people in Batiklo. This, uh, I have put a picture there and they came to golf for the Gaul Music Festival and it's not easy to dance with them. I try to dance with them. Their rhythms are very fast and very fast steps, right? So these two, are, uh, they belong to uh, that group uh, and the original, uh, the Kapirinya, uh, they they have both, uh, they have usually only the uh, Portug in Portuguese lang language, but later on, we used to mix both and sing. So one of the original about uh, describing and uh, appreciating the lovely uh, city of Baticolo, it's, it's like this. Terra visti terra, nosso baticlo terra, te dia na santo dos caravi. Oia visti terra, creme dos agrandes, pensita canta visti terra. Oia visti terra, creme dos agrandes, pensita canta visti terra. Ranco. And could do it, Amala, Atikaran, got the Malagiravi Atahirin, the Kila, Aikia, New Hila, Hitua, the Dalaya, Aikiala. So the same kind of tune is taken into our baila. And these people, they still preserve and very simple instruments, a dolak and some spoons and some uh, coconut shells, polkatu. Right, so that kind of simple instruments they use. One of their songs is uh, they are, they usually sing two or three lines and then they increase the tempo. Bala rangum deko, bala rangum de, bala rangum deko, bala rangum de, bala rangum deko, bala rangum de. So like that, they increase the tempo. So this is this has created lot of beautiful songs uh, from Irene Josephine, Rosaline Mandolin, that song, and then a lot of other. Keith Pascoe sings a nice one. I can't remember all the songs now. Uh, I will ask them to play a, mel a medley uh, of Baila. Over to you. Why did you 
Sepin Rosaling Angeling Nathering Pathering Natai the Catering Piano Banjo Tamarin Mandolin Violin Violin Loke no Nasena Violin Viole Masana Sena Viole Viole Oba Magi Ata Mevele Nana Ve recording music that uh, that is a very important milestone in uh, music evolution because then only we, we because unless you go to some other country you might not witness or if, uh, if they come to our country that is the only way we can exchange music but due to these gramophone records uh, we were able to take and listen to music of other countries 
So one of the, the early gramophone records were by uh, Rupa Singha Master and Rukmani Devi. Hope you all can remember. Siri Buddha Kaya Vihare Vadine Moksha Patala Siri Buddha Kaya Vihare Vadine Moksha Patala so that is one of the beautiful ones and then our national anthem before it's Sri Lanka Mata it was Namo Namo Mata and you can see the record the gramophone record it was done in India by Ananda Samarakorn and also C.T. Fernando did number of uh, uh, gramophone records and the other lady the I ask Krokila Devi Viratunga uh, who did a lot of gramophone records. One of her favorite songs were Mau Pio Adi Sonduru Tamage Kula De Tu Wan Sema Mau Pio Adi Sonduru Tamage Kula De Tu Wan Sema Though she was uh, originally uh, from, uh, she's a Tamil lady, but very perfect Sinhala pronunciation in Kokila Devi Virutunga. So there were beautiful uh, CDs, uh, sorry, uh, gramophone records, and later on uh, it went to the uh, discs, the CDs, and small cassettes. So I hope you can remember we put a pencil. <laughs> so, like that, uh, the recording of music uh, helped us a lot. Today we have this. Google will help <laughs> anything and everything you can search but those days that was the only way and these records if you go to SLBC they still they have the record room that is the most precious thing for me the record room of SLBC because they keep uh, the all these records and then came because we got to know about other songs especially the Indian ones and the uh, western ones we used to imitate like the, they call the copy sindhu right copy the thing imitate right so the Tamil song I think everybody know this the Tamil one Adi ennadi rakamma Tell the singhala, sing the singhala one Kanemi kar kar bandala punchi hamine bhala uvenden Mama innemi maharaja vaghe mekame kaatattu daukar hamin Mama kanemi kar kar bandala punchi hamine bhala uvenden Mama innemi maharaja vaghe mekame uh, this is from a Tamil film and who, if you all seen the film there are two ladies and uh, hope Raghunathan sir can remember this and one gentleman is dancing with two ladies at the end of the Rakama. and the wooden heart I think all of you all know uh, the Singhala song do you know the Singhala one the copy song Em loke pura oba silva suda mal mal gota pal dan gele tala ki gav dole mal pi pudu kele in kham hitia so this is the exact copy of Wooden Heart. And next one I think we all know this. Mulu 
संसारे में जीवन मूल संसारे उदार 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 याद मात के ले मात के ले उदार 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 जीवन Father, and I think uh, you also sang it so beautifully. I really like the song, and uh, so we started doing the exact copy of the whatever the Sinhala, uh, um, the Tamil, Hindi, or whatever the song. So because of this, uh, there were so many songs like exact copies, and then because of that, there was another era where we thought of no, this is not going to help us. We should have. our own kind of music so let's all sing together sunil shantas kokilayange kokilanade kokilayange kokilanade kokilayange kokilanade ईन हडीन वगे ईन हडीन वगे जाति जाति मलिन सुन उराबी वटीन पिटीन सिर सुलंगे सामदान सद सुबह अन्न अन्न इरत मूद किले बागे कुमारी आल तो टिले पद मुनि दल्ले कोकिल यंगे कोकिल नादे कोकिल यंगे कोकिल नादे इन हनी इन वागे ये दी इन हनी इन वागे ये दी सुदो सुदो अन्न सदन के बिन्दे साधु साधु ओ बेद साई पलने ये पाए पास ने निकल देने ऐ द मगे सुदा मटाई आदरे अन्न दे उड़ियो अपे पे बाला गीत का यंगो ओ किल यंगे समन मालक ने लागे बिशोगे इसी कसा अन्न मागे बिनो दे इन आने इन मागे कुमारी साधु किया हाथु दे कत्तिन सिरी मागे की रिंदे हाथी सुमिहिरी काया हमाकी कोकी नयन के कोकी नादे कोकी नयन के कोकी नादे इन हाथी इन वागे के ये दी इन वागे इन तत्सुतो मैंने सागरे ओ भाई मागे मैंने कमागे आदरे इतने पास है कत मागे सुंदरी मेलो इलो ओ भाई मागे पेम्बरी मागे अशोका मागे विशाका मागे मालिका ओ किलयन के ओ किलनादे कोकिलयंगे कोकिलनादी इन हनी इन वगे ये दी 
So this was the trend after that. So Mr. Makulolu, uh, then see the school at Ilaka, who wrote, Dethate Valelu, Yanmutu well malapotai, Yayate Ilelu. Punkusuman se babele. E hande canelu. One senek in can pinevai. La literu siru. Sunder sun sun gamenai. So those were the new songs. And Lionel Ranwell, I think his son is doing a great job now. Sunil Shanta, Amaradeva, Nanda Malini, she created. If you listen to her very very first songs the, which she created music sari podi tak and the gina mala podi tak band the gina diga podi tak yannata kata karavi kata karala mangal niyama karavi kata karala mangal niyama karavi so hope you remember those songs. Ran giri 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 valalu sala sala komal landu gayan sindu. Ran giri 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 valalu sala sala komal landu gayan sindu savan pimnar avamina. Lavan hasin sarasala Netang bellum balabala Lavan hasin sarasala Netang bellum balabala So these are beautiful creations. So uh, to to fight against the imitation songs or the copy songs, they brought up this new uh, sing music where these are those are their own creations and they experimented a lot. Neela Vikrama Singh, T M Jayaratna also belonged to the same group. And then what happened was this was so popular among. Uh, Sri Lanka, these new songs, easy to sing also. And uh, C.T. Fernando also joined this. Ambili mami oba mokada karani. So like, sorry, that is Kokirani. That's the difference with you, na? Pulun valayati nida nevila balani. Ambili mami oba mokada karani. So those were simple to sing, nice songs. So it was very popular. And there was a clash between people who graduated from where I graduated, Bath Kande, and the people, uh, Sunil Shanta, he is a graduate from Bath Kande as well as uh, from uh, Shanti Niketan, uh, where Rabindranath Tagore was. So, because of, I think, thinking of Gandhi and Ravindranath Tagore, they wanted to create something unique for the country. But this, the classical musicians, uh, actually, they said, we have to grade the singers and you just can't sing something you want. And they invited the principal of Bath Kande University uh, at that time, Pandit Ratan Jankar, to Sri Lanka and graded the musicians. And, uh, but Sunil Shant and them said, no, we are not going for those tests. Uh, we will quit. And they left uh, the SLBC and they did their things uh, apart from, you know, they never went to SLBC. And so they, because they were not graded, they were not allowed to sing songs at uh, Radio Ceylon or SLBC. So then this orchestra and the Indian, more North Indian classical type of music uh, became very prominent those days. And the good thing is they started Haywood uh, as the place to learn music. And the, this is the SLBC orchestra. And uh, this is Mr. Lionel Edrisinghe. So the classical musicians, uh, 
Dr. Sujata Attanayaka, Dr. Amra Ranatunga, they all gave classical and semi-classical songs for us. But they are beautiful ones, if you know uh, this one by Victor Attanayaka. Lema vila piya karu hasundarani Lema vila piya karu hasundarani when a chanchala nada sat saradiani. So that is Rag Bageshri. Kafi mail got a shard of a poor and a rag ki madu bageshri. So those are very classical, full classical songs. But apart from that, songs like this. Sit dear El Sala Pium Pipuna Bala Dedanetal Dova Aruna Lodi Siotn Kelenatti Udingiatn Bimingiatn Maki Hitin So this is again Bhim Palashri. But that touches there in all three songs. Nila Varna Nila Kobeyu. Obey Nila Netu Sangalin. Sita Dira Sala. All these songs have the same touch. So the classical influence came. And also the North Indian, not only North Indian classical, South Indian classical, Rag Khalavati is used for many Sinhala songs. This one. Heavy Luno Guinea del Nivi Niviati, a matter Hamu Supi Puno Vane Malsu and the Hamadi Atten del Pendagin Mangma Watten Villa Ohe Evida Gia Kale Mataka. This is Rag Kalavati from South Indian classical music. So this era, lot of classical songs uh, came into the uh, ear of our people. And nevertheless, they are very beautiful and nice. So then we'll move to the another era where the mix of all these came and where the music came into films as background music as well as the uh, songs. So we'll sing together Eta Gauga Nandurin, Lokaye Noekratin. This uh, music composition by Pandit Tamaradeva. Uh, and um, this is from Getavaru, I think. I think I'm correct. Getavaru, no? Arichi Gorichi. And in 1970s, lots of the nice films came. That is, I think, the best era for music, cinema, and everything in 70s. Shall we? At the Gaukan and Duri, Loka, he do it, Cutty. At the Gaukan and Duri, 
just to play a small teeny beeny bit of uh, film uh, background music guess what the film is kolu hadavata you all can remember golu hadavata no words nothing but that little bit of music brings that memories to us karuna sena jayalat golu hadavata and then the songs a teri mam a teri dammi tav mat a teri aadri mam aadri so the those are beautiful songs and uh, other artists who did directors these are all directors uh, master kemadas is the giant here but uh, the other uh, other this is uh, somasiri le singh who did master amaradeva with him he did sindu sudumudu talave Uh, and Shelton Premer Ratna uh, and uh, Sarad Dasanayak, Rohan Veera Singh. So all of them created beautiful film music, uh, which we still remember. Uh, so nine, if you have time, please watch the movies in nineteen seventies. Every each and every one of them had beautiful music, especially the background music. 
Vasanta e Davasak, those, it's in 80s, I suppose, yeah, but still very beautiful background music. So then uh, I would take you from there to uh, the group uh, music, or the Kandayam Sangeet, the Calypso, and those things. So this song is uh, Joby Pereira's uh, Bees, group Bees, right? So it's a very famous one, Mulugatama Vehesuna, the Hadi and Narona. Mulugatama Vehesuna, the Hadi and Narona, Kusakina Niva, Ganda Mimaya, Kadetalana. Mulukatama Vesuna, the Hadi in the Heona, Usakina Niva, Ganda Mimaya, Kadetala, Vesila, Dukidala, Kamele, Akadetala, Vesila, Dukidala, Kamele, Akadetala. Devi and the Pudela, Daruan Mu and Sibala, Gini Mele Dalbella, Yaka de Gini of Kerala, Bolutela Dam Hadela, Galata Pano Padela, Dava Sibeda Arabala, Bulukata Mabe Hisuna, Nadi in the Heuna, Pusagina Niva, Dana Mima, Yaka de Talana, Bulukata Mabe Hisuna. Dahadi ne heuna, usakin ne niwa, gan ne meva ya tede balan. Dadu adu tadkala, ya kade hit hai kala, net varu yodala. Pina kiri kiri thala, pigiya head head thala, muat pander tiela, edu ve kamal tiela, baagi varu ne penna. Mulu katam ve suna, dahadi ne heuna, kusagi ne ni ma gan ve ma ya kade thala na. Mulu katam ve suna, dahadi ne heuna, kusagi ne ni ma gan ve ma ya kade thala na. Yakade pande mage mila, var baagi pere mila, malag nata mila, mama varu ne pinnala, khadi budi evadkera, var baagi na hidala, yali ye var mila, mulu kate mave suna, dahi ne heuna, usagi na niwa gan na me maya kade talan na, mulu kate mave suna, dahi ne heuna. Usagin na niwa gan na me maya kade talan We sila dumidala kamle ya kade talan We sila dumidala kamle ya kade talan So this is I think a song where I Usually we talk about love and other things, but this is somebody who is working hard for his earning. And these songs are common in the West, but I think this is the time we also started thinking in that line and created songs for people who were considered less. And then the Calypso and the music groups came, Clarence, uh, then uh, Neville Fernando, Rukmani Devi, Gypsies, they all, come, not only the music, they try to, you know, 
give some thoughts for us to think also from their songs because the music melody is very lively and uh, very uh, attractive people used to listen to them more and uh, the the what the messages were given uh, were very clear uh, though the lyrics were very simple you know so prabuddha novana unata these are very uh, effective music uh, messages were communicated effectively uh, hope you all remember this song um, uh, one which says dana dana varadi karanawa uh what is the first verse i can remember pahasu ata vasi ata dana dana varadi karanawa ehima kalat nidahas ata kiyanna karunu tiyanawa natinam hadala kiyanawa natinam mavala kiyanawa so things like that it you know our weaknesses like your marcus aurelius approach to different approach but our simple singers they directly told this is wrong this is right and this is how you should do uh, so there are a lot of nice songs i think badegini tethi de you must be hungry so i will not uh, go through all the group songs but one thing i have to tell when they start especially clarence and them three sisters when they started they uh, asked uh, for an opportunity in the slbc slbc to you know broadcast their songs but it was not given in the singhala section so vijay korea from the english channel gave them opportunity to sing the their songs the calypsos and uh, the these songs because 6 8 beat was uh, not considered as a higher quality uh, beat for good kind of songs so these were our differences but uh, they 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 bypass that and they were very popular among most of the people and then uh, we are going to discuss few things about the drama songs the new drama songs uh, one example is so bhavade let's sing that together so bhavade i don't know the the words are not very clear no my slide is not good This is from Tara O Igileti by Lucian Bulat Singhala. The first, uh, the initially sung by uh, I think um, U R Y Vimal and uh, Gunasena Galapati. Nowadays, Rodney Varna Kula and other people sing this song. Okay, well, let's sing. ിമദസിതവി <laughs> സ 
so that is from tara oigileti and drama music uh, the, the uh, there are few eras in drama music but a uh, few things i think we we can fondly remember these things vajira chitrasena they did something similar to ballet in sri lanka uh, hope you can remember naladamayanti and karadiya and adrivira sar dr professor adrivira sarachandra nadagam style was taken forward and he did maname singha bahu pemati jayati soko and many other uh, stage dramas and uh, henry jayasena Uh, who produced uh, Hunuate Katav from Chalk Circle and Kuveni and he used a lot of instruments in the stage. Usually stage dramas, the minimum use of instruments are there but he brought the cymbals and all the western uh, instruments uh, for especially for uh, Hunuate Katav. and uh, so the music of uh, these three sections the usually uh, dr sarachandra's ones we call shaili gatanat that is the go in line with the uh, nadagam and the style the western style and eastern style mixed uh, chitrasena in his drama his dramas the musicals and uh, mr jayasena did us totally different one uh, using uh, new costumes and new uh, kind of uh, songs into uh, stage so hope you remember uh, these songs hatara denek sempati o sempati an ge geete hatara denek sempati o magata wedi yudata giyo yuddata giya olu gediyo unge hati kiya piyo unge hati kiya piyo and then came duets and romantic music i think people who were um, young who were young in 70s i think all the love letters uh, they said there was one line from milton malavarachi's uh, song that if, if without that a love letter is not a love letter it seems and uh, uh, all these singers they gave us beautiful lovely uh, music duets romantic music Uh, so because the time is less uh, otherwise we should have sung you all must be hungry no badigine da ne kiwata kama ne da badigine ne badigine and i will sing some, uh, some songs from 70s uh, miltons and uh, all these lovely duets a little bit of each tani vi sitin these beautiful songs and even while taking dinner uh, the kapilani is there krishanti is also there and lot of sing- other singers i can see uh, especially angelines and uh, jyoti palas songs uh, neela vikramasinghe uh, and uh, tm jayaratna Th- those songs uh, we will cherish the, the, the in the black and white picture it's lata and uh, dharmadasa valpola 
so lovely duets and romantic music uh, especially milton's ones are like mag tot di hamu vendi apat kata heduna lob kelambi gili gandi de dina bala sitiya upulnu anvid ha obasina suna mamasina suna pulun podakkalama land ki vasna nam mona lisa so those are beautiful augustus vinayagaratnam who wrote that song and uh, certain duets like uh, i don't know whether you have sarungale this is, so this is from sarungale bamarindu uh, bamarindu kumat vadinne vanamal kekuli suya vadinne vanamal kekuli kimad suyanni labunot ay pem pavas niven malin malat madira tulgava mal makarandaya muluvatana mamara kusum hadavat yugayava demi hemras pawa so these are beautiful songs uh, the duets and the romantic kind of music which we have produced and the newer trends there are a lot of things because i went through the past but you have witnessed i think uh, most of us uh, uh, have witnessed from 60s afterwards so usually now the music trends are to use lot of technology computer based and lot of mixing styles are used those days the whole orchestra should be there for the singer to sing now each and every one can sing and uh, go their part and they will cut paste mix and make a nice and even you don't have to sing also if you talk they can make music out of it but still that is important and it 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 saves lot of time when, when i was a child singer we spent the whole day in slb so to record or maybe two days to record one song because all the pieces should put it in together at one go but now we can sing our part and then go so there are good things about it and there are good young musicians and very talented intelligent and we can uh, see a good future Uh, especially the our uh, some youngsters so i ask um, i invite uh, you all to sing few few lines of the newer songs uh, the good ones the nice ones popular ones pratihari nura मीन दैसे मवा रूप सारी मवी पेना चंद्र सो बार से पाना मन आशारटा पाना नित पैरी सोभा नित पैरी सोभा हम दे 
So some people say, nah, the younger generation is not up to the standard. I think they are up and even uh, more better than us. If they can uh, use their talents and new technology and do something like that. So whatever it is, what I feel is uh, in Sri Lanka, we have Sinhalese, Tamil, Burga, Muslim, lot of communities. But Sri Lankan Muslim is different from other Muslims. Sri Lankan Tamils are different from Tamils in some other place. So the music is also, though we have influence from all these things, and sometimes even the pronunciation and things we, we imitate, and or the singers like Jikki, Jamuna, Rani, their pronunciation is different, but nevertheless, the beauty of the song is the same. Even Dalrin Subi sings a singular song, it's still beautiful, only her pronunciation is the slightly different and that difference also gives a, a something nice for me at least prana hatak tena bakila pang hatak patu kerua pandar menale gihilna hite taraturul laru kila gilila awat magirang kurula so because if you sing no, with without the accent uh, this one is beautiful Oh, yenda, oh, yenda, preeti vanda maha, no na mahatini me balanna, yenna, yenna, me diha, oh, yenna. Eke lasa naktina, there's a beauty in there. So, I think what we should see is the beauty in everything, beauty of these songs, the music, and Sri Lankan music is unique. It's not anything else, though we have taken bits and pieces from world music, classical, pop, and various genres, a lot of genres are there in Sri Lanka. But we have that uniqueness. Uh, that uniqueness is important. And hope you all enjoyed the music and we'll sing this song together. And that's the end of uh, my uh, story about Sri Lankan music. Uh, thank you for listening. And thank you, uh, dear students, uh, for playing uh, the Dasun and uh, all the others. So we'll sing this Niva song, Sisi Kadavisuruna, originally written and sung by uh, um, Batagoda. What's, what's the first name? Uh, Senaka Batagoda. And uh, Vayo sang it later. Uh, so this is a nice, meaningful song. We'll, song, uh, we'll sing this together. And uh, we'll, I wish you all a very good night and enjoy music. Thank you. See, 
enjoyed that video and the recording as much as I did. Although it was a long video, nearly one and a half hours, that was not a single boring moment. I hope you would agree with me. So thank you very much, Madam, uh, for that wonderful uh, lecture and keeping us entertained throughout that. That day as well as today when I was listening to that, it all came back. Thank you so much. So uh we we open the forum to questions now if there are any questions madam uh, harshan rajpakshi is there uh joining online with us if anybody has any questions or any comments while there are uh, questions coming in from the audience madam uh to refresh the memory that day uh during the event at goal live there was a very interesting question from the audience asking uh like why do you think that the Sri Lankan music is so diverse. Would you like to revisit that question? I think uh, it's mainly uh, due to the influences we had and why the influences were there is the place where our country is situated. We are a small country in a very important uh, place. Uh, all the ships uh, and all the travelers from the ancient days uh, used to stop at our harbors, stop at uh, various uh, harbors in Sri Lanka. So a lot of influence came to our, uh, our country and with the travelers and with the people who came, uh, our music 
uh, evolved and uh, took uh, these uh, beautiful colors into it. Uh, in short, I think that's why we have a very rich and very, um, very lot, a music with a lot of variety. I hope it's clear. Yes, thank you, madam. So basically being in the center of the Indian Ocean and at a very strateg strategically important place, I think has added its beauty to the culture as well as to the music. Uh, yeah, so there are some comments from the audience. Thank you for that wonderful lecture. And I have to agree. It was like there wasn't a boring minute. Thank you very much, madam. And actually, because of the time, I couldn't touch on actually the era between 80s to Mm, uh, 90s like a lot of new musicians uh, came like Vinesh Subhasingha and a lot of musicians came like that and uh, groups like Bhati and Santush, Siha Shakti and a lot of new groups came up and the singers also like Uresha Ravihari uh, and um, Kasun Kalhar, Amal so all these people because of the time and because we were all there during that era. Uh, I was unable to include everything, so just a glimpse. Uh, and uh, if you listen to all of those, you'll realize uh, what, what uh, nice uh, flavors we have in our music. And thank you for the comments. Uh, That's true, thank you very much, madam. Are there any more questions from the audience or any comments? There's one in q and I I don't know how to... Uh, uh, yes. I don't know whether... Uh, all right, okay. It's a comment. Uh, there's a comment asking, yes. <laughs> Whether it's, uh, it's there in the college website to watch later. Uh, yes, it will be. It will be available on YouTube and we will be sharing the link with all members uh, soon enough uh, so that everybody who like missed this so like joined in later can watch later. It's very interesting. You should. Yes. The best is to sing uh, with live music and uh, have fun. Uh, yes, madam. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, and there's another comment saying thank you very much for the wonderful le uh, lecture from Dr. Ananda Tapattu. Uh, thank you for joining us then. Uh, so in the absence of further questions, I think given uh, it's very late, we will end uh, wind up the session for today. Thank you very much, Madam, for joining us live to answer any questions. And thank you very much again, once again, for that wonderful performance on behalf of the Council of the CCP. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And I'm also very uh, happy to you do this lecture because that is one of my favorite, uh, I, something I really enjoy, personally enjoy. So thank you for giving me the opportunity, President and the Council. And uh, thank you for joining. Good night to everybody. Bye for now. Thank you, Madam. Good night. Good night. <laughs>